Hola amigos, it's Will here from Will's Custom Figures coming at you today with a big bad breakdown of the NFL's Walter Payton from his match in the WWF. So please sit back and relax while I talk you through why and how I made this guy and everything else in between. So firstly, let's start with why. Well, Walter Payton was actually one of the greatest NFL American football players throughout the 80s and 90s. I personally didn't know him until his time in the WWF, where he was the enforcer and he worked with the one and only legendary Razor Ramon, Scott Hall, in his SummerSlam 92 match. I might be right in saying that. <laughs> Without Google, I'm just going from my memory. But as you can see, this guy oozing with charisma. What an absolutely brilliant smile. I'm so happy with how it turned out. And a lot of time and effort went into painting this guy, making sure it was fit for purpose. And of course, let's call out the elephant in the room. This badass oozing machismo t-shirt from this era. Back when Razor Ramon Scott Hall was his absolute peak. Um, like what an absolutely fantastic wrestler I hadn't got all the fame of the NWO and everything at this point and what a badass t-shirt oh my god like if I could get one of these <laughs> I would get one of these they're so cool so um, yeah use the Nasty Boys figure as a base for this and uh, as you can see the sort of two-tone yellow it goes from a real bright yellow on this side I'm going to do a real close-up for you guys here we go um, slice down the neck or oh, love that v-neck when people just used to tear them out because I think it was actually just a normal like normal t-shirt um, and uh, here he is the bad guy Reza Ramon so um, it goes round two tone over the shoulder as the yellow and the sort of like creamish whitish yellow blend together and then here we go on the back another bad ass razor you can see a little bit more of his face here on this one and I'm so happy with how this turned out. Just to give you guys a bit of an idea, the effort it went into making this guy, uh, obviously, clearly a nasty boy's base. Um, I've then used clay from the um, from the shoes, from the boots to cover them up all the way up to the top. I've done a belt out of the little bit that crosses over here. Um, and then uh, used clay to make a 3D t-shirt as you can see it goes all the way around really really enjoyed making this guy and uh, what a character what a face i'm just going to zoom in a little bit on that face so you can see some of the detail on there look at that that's like almost looking like at a picture of the guy oh i'm so happy with how that turned out um but yeah please guys i hope you've enjoyed this video i wish i had a razor ramon figure to put him next to so you could see how cool he looks however i have got uh, another stand in a bit of another legend from this period and uh, here he is the ultimate warrior absolute terrible quality ultimate warrior so sorry about that but um yeah he's going to be used for a crystal figure very very soon so uh yeah no apologies actually i'll take that back so guys please like like comment subscribe easy for me to say on facebook instagram youtube hopefully you like this video if you want one of these Please feel free to get in touch if you want to just make one. I've got all the parts for Walter Payton or anybody else that you may want. And from myself, from this guy who is absolutely oozing machismo, just like his counterpart Razor Ramon in that classic, classic match. Please, I hope you've had a great video. I certainly have enjoyed speaking to you. Take it easy. I'll speak to you soon. Bye.